Thank you for staying with us. The Office of Transformation and Service Delivery, OTSD, in Ikiti State is organizing a two-day workshop for other ministries, departments, and agencies in the state. The workshop will focus on Ikiti Service Delivery and Performance Measurement and will take place today and tomorrow in Adwekiti. Now, the objective of the workshop is to discuss the Ikiti Performance Assessment and Improvement Report. All MDAs in the state are expected to access ECPER, which is designed to achieve the six strategic actionable pillars of Gabna Abiodun Yibanji's administration. To discuss the importance of the workshop, Dr. John Ekundayo, Special Advisor to OTSD, Ikiti State, joins us via Zoom from Adwikiti to talk more on this. Good morning, Dr. Ekundayo. Thank you for joining us. Uh, Veronica, good morning. Now, let's talk about uh, this two-day um, performance measurement workshop and how critical it is. Talk to us from the perspective of how critical it is. Um, yeah, this uh, two-day workshop um, is target AKT Performance Assessment Improvement <coughs> Report uh, with the code name or acronym ECPIA. And, um, it's actually uh, to, this is the second edition. We had the first edition last right. uh, last year, uh, September and uh, early October. So we are building on the baseline, the foundation we had last year, basically. So that's what we are doing, uh, looking at the whole metrics again. We are looking at leadership, we are looking at uh, workforce, we are looking at constituents, whether the people are getting feedback or whatever we are doing uh, at the uh, followership level. You know, we are looking at uh, uh, work, workforce, uh, the workforce within the MDAs, we are analyzing that. We are analyzing a lot of things, the programs, the projects, you know, and what kind of indicators, measurement analysis. Uh, and then we, we sum this up and then we, we come out with the outcome. And even before the outcome, we want to look at the strategy planning within the organization, you know, the vision, the mission, the goal, uh, and aligning it with the six strategic actionable pillars of the Governor Bioda Bio Evangelist Administration. Uh, the pillars, uh, you know, widely uh, publicized within the state and even online, talking about uh, youth development and job creation talking about uh, uh, human capital development, talking about culture and right development, talking about arts, culture and tourism, infrastructure and industrialization, and also talking about governance. So the six strategic action pillars we want to align the MDAs and which aspect actually belongs to the MDA and which uh, you know, uh, of these uh, actionable goals that you have two or three or four MDAs have to work together, have to collaborate, in order to achieve. So we have been having conversation along this line. We want to deepen the, the, the conversation this time around. And then the first APR we had, September, October last year, serves at the baseline. So this one now, we want to look at it and then together we work on this. And then from there, we can assess and we can see room, rooms, whether we have rooms for improvement. And then we look at performance at the same time. And this is just one of the metrics of the performance. There are other metrics of performance that mutually they are being a party between the, uh, the, the, the ESCO members, uh, the political appointees, and the Office of Transformation and Service Delivery, OTSD, in Adwekiti uh, regarding this particular uh, uh, um, uh, assessment exercise that uh, the office is carrying out. So that's a bit I can uh, tell us now about uh, the APR workshop coming up today.